Hey friends, wanted to talk today about a word that I invented. This is one of my games that I play is trying to invent words, especially when I feel that the existing language that's been offered to me is sort of impoverished, where there's a gap in what I want to say and how I want to articulate myself and then the words and phrases and idioms that are available to me. There's this meme that was going around on Twitter for a while, like a, a text-based phrasal meme of neither X nor Y, but a third more complex thing and or a third secret thing. And I was sort of searching for a word like that, where I wanted to describe my own projects and the work I was doing with a word other than either professional or unprofessional. And I wanted a word that meant neither professional nor unprofessional, but a third more complex secret thing. And I guess the reason I wanted such a word was that both of those existing words, professional and unprofessional, had aspects that I resonated with and aspects that I didn't resonate with. On the one hand, I really value being, you know, uh, excellent at the things I do and doing them well and efficiently and effectively like a professional would, but I don't value sort of the gestalt or, you know, mental image of like working in a cubicle, having a pressed shirt, collared shirt, or a tie, or having to show up at meetings, you know, or work a nine to five or something like that. Having a 401k, this sort of contemporary Western gestalt around what it means to have a job and sort of sacrifices that you make around that, those didn't resonate for me because that's, that's just not how I work. And on the other hand, of course, I don't want to be unprofessional. I don't want to do things sloppily or poorly or overlook things, but I do value a kind of fluidity and casualness and I'd say awkwardness about work where you remember that it's a human that's doing the work and they're not pretending to be some perfect being they're being themselves and working in a way that's authentic to who they are, their full self really, and not just who they are on that project, but you know the different values and be manners of being that they have manifesting in their work. You know, for me, I'm kind of silly, or I like sex and sexuality is part of my life, or I'm playful, or get really interested in certain things and or have very specific spiritual and religious views or practices, and can I bring those to my work? Can I show those? And for those reasons, professional and unprofessional sort of resonated and sort of didn't resonate, and I started looking for a third word, and thankfully one just sort of arrived in my mind, and when I thought of it I was just so pleased. I was so pleased. I was like, oh this is it. This is just the word. And almost like some part of me knew that it was there and was just looking for it. And then when I found it, I was like, yep, this is the word. And it was, it was almost too good to be true, but it's, it's just perfect. It's just, is the word, which is fun, professional, fun, professional. And I love this because fun is such a important value for me. And especially in work, I want to be doing projects that are fun. I want to be having fun while I work and I believe that that makes for more excellent work, that having fun holds you to a higher quality of standard of quality for the work that you do and also is of more benefit in the world. And it's not just doing a really good job at work that no one ultimately actually needs. The fun is sort of a compass to work that the world actually needs and benefits from. And it still has that lightheartedness, that playfulness of that hint of unprofessionalism, the parts that I do resonate with, of just sort of being fluid and human and whole 
and also, yeah, professional, holding yourself to excellence, doing things well, accomplishing things effectively that you do care about while having fun while you do it. It has all of those elements and connotations just already in the sound of the word. And so when, mm, when we recently renamed the organization that I've been creating to the Service Guild, I have so far been describing it as a fun professional working cooperative or working collective. It's not currently a nonprofit, it's not a company, it's sort of informal between friends, and it's fun professional. We want to do things well, but we want to have fun while we do it. We want to be our whole selves. We don't want to pretend to be someone that we're not, and that's fun professional. So I wanted to share this word with you and tell you a little bit about where it came from and uh, why I use it, and feel free to use it yourself if it resonates for you.